We're here back at the shop again tonight. Going to check the progress on Pappy's timing the 9600. Like I showed before, it's been split with the front end pulled off. Basically torn down the front of the engine, taking the covers off. So the timing gears are exposed. The back end of the tractor propped up on some railroad ties and a jack. The front end we actually put on a roller so we can roll it in, roll it back out to bolt the side plates back up. You end up with the power parts over here. You have the side panels. Have the side plate. Here's the official nameplate Dad put on it. Okay, we're going to take a look at this 9600. Right now it is set at zero degrees. And once again, this block heater's in the way. I hope you can see that's zero degrees with the line is about in the center of that slot. Now, on the injection gear, two marks are lined up where the center punches are in the same tooth. Auxiliary drive and the idler gear lined up. Let's go down here, which I'll slide this back out again. That is lined up. Then the other thing we can do, we'll rotate that so that the 23 degree mark comes up by using our ratchet. Also have to watch these pieces of metal sticking out here. I keep sticking my head up, standing up underneath them. So we're going to rotate this 23 degrees using the ratchet. Kind of been an interesting deal with this because it runs so good just has no power. Okay, what we're looking at there in the hole, 23 degree mark. As it's marked with chalk so we can see it. And up front here, on the injection pump gear, those two marks are lined up. On the back of the pump, we'll try to get a better video of this than I did last night. Don't know that I can actually get a good video. There's a mark just below that bolt hole there and there's also a V groove on that and they are lined up. So that should be perfectly timed. So now we've actually lined it up at zero, lined the gears up and then we turned it 23 degrees made sure that the pump gears are lined up front and back. And that should be it. The next step be to reassemble the engine and hopefully it'll have more power and it won't smoke so bad.